So to begin this segment, I will be first introducing the history of bead looming. It all began in America where the Native Americans lived. But when the Europeans came, that's when bead looming became more modernized by using different materials. But before the Europeans came, bead looms were used as belts called wapum. They usually came from shells, stones, metal, and ceramics. And with these materials, they would create beautiful stories. Bead looming was a part of a beautiful cultural background. Many people still create bead looms and their tradition still lives. This idea of bead looming can be described in many words, but most of all, it is a beautiful work of art. So what did the computer scientists who made virtual bee looming need to know about? The first thing is general mathematics, more specifically about the Cartesian plane. They would need to have very good knowledge of how to make computer programs as well. Last but not least, they would also need to know about the history of bee looms as they incorporated the traditional bee loom making to create a virtual simulation. There are two main aspects that connect to bead looming. The first is culturally as it comes from the Native American beadworks. It also relates to mathematics because of the Cartesian plane base it uses. The first mathematical connection is that it uses fourfold symmetry, meaning it reflects from left to right and top to bottom. Another connection is that it uses a Cartesian coordinate plane. On the plane, each quadrant can be one of the four symmetrical sides. To instruct where one dot will be placed, you will have an x-coordinate horizontally and a y-coordinate vertically. These points can be negative or positive. Four points will reflect each other using fourfold symmetry. One more connection is that through the designs, one can end up creating lines, triangles, rectangles, and other geometrical shapes. To create our designs, we use the website. Here you have a Cartesian plane and a place to insert the coordinates of the points you want to place. The online simulation includes many features that allow you to make different shapes and colors.